Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, we're gonna talk about the new file explorer that we will see most likely in the year 2023 in Windows 11, of course. And we've talked about in previous videos that Microsoft is working on completely overhauling the file explorer experience in Windows 11 with a new design that should better match the Windows 11 experience. And of course, we saw that in a previous builds on the dev channel that Microsoft has started testing out a new details pane. But in this video, we're gonna discuss over a screenshot that was provided to the Windows community by windowscentral.com. So full credits to them for the screenshot that we're going to discuss upon in this video. If you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. Before starting the video, a quick message from our video sponsor. This video is sponsored by KeysOff.com. KeysOff.com offers Windows Office and other tools licenses at a very favorable price. For example, you can get the Windows 10 Pro license for just $7 by using the coupon code TB50 and you can also upgrade for free to Windows 11 by using the coupon code TB50. You can also get Windows 11 Pro for just $13. Office licenses have even a better discount with 62% off by using the coupon code TB62. Check out the great prices from keysoff.com and the links from the description below and don't forget to apply the coupon codes. Thank you to keysoff.com for the sponsorship. Let's continue with the video. So as I've said, we have here a screenshot that was provided by Windows Central. And what you need to note is that this is an internal mockup. So the finished product could look different, but basically this is the design that Microsoft is going for. So let's open up the screenshot to show you how this would look. As you can see here, we have a lot of changes in the file explorer. So first of all, as you can see, we have changes regarding the top bar from file explorer. The tabs experience looks pretty much the same, but this header is also changed with other buttons. As you can see here, the backwards, the forwards, also the refresh button. We have the home quick launch here. And also we can see the location we are in with this nice thing. And we also have the search, which is a bit different with a nice little drop down there. Also the new copy and paste buttons, as you can see, they are no longer here. They will most likely be moved just below the header. As you can see here, new copy, paste, and all those with the view filtering from where we can also enable the details pane. In my opinion, this this looks better than what we have now because the experience is much cleaner and we have a lot more space. Also, as you can see in the left side, we have a redesigned section of the navigation menu. I'm sure with animations that match the Windows 11 experience as we have in the settings app or in the task manager, as you can see with the same icons, of course, but the experience should be a little bit different. But I think this is very good because the file explorer, especially the navigation pane, looks a bit old for this experience that we are having now in Windows 11. Also, so you can notice in the front, we have a new recommended section that we've talked about and that we will be able to disable or enable as we've talked about in a different video because of some findings that Seno Panther did on Twitter. So I think this is also interesting. We have thumbnails, we have big thumbnails for this and also some other information that we can of course see. We have the pinned files and we also have the recent files, which is not something really, really different. And also some buttons here, I think related to the grid and, and also to how the files will be shown in the file explorer. In addition to this, we should be able to see a new gallery section that Microsoft has started working on the dev channel from a few builds ago, and that should appear somewhere in the left side. And also we have the new details pane that we've talked about that can be enabled and the details pane will match this experience that we see here with this file explorer. I'm looking forward to hearing your opinion on this new file explorer that may be coming in the year 2023 if Microsoft manages to finish this experience. But of course, the release date is most likely the next major build for Windows 11, which would be 23H2. And that would be somewhere in September, October, maybe even November. So as I've said, let me know below in the comments what you think about this. How do you like the new design, the new experience? I think this is way better because it matches the Windows 11 experience better. Yet again, a big thank you to Zach from Windows Central for providing this screenshot and for allowing us, the community, to see more useful information like this. If you enjoyed this video, please don't don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. And of course, don't forget to leave a comment below. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.